Oh, snap. All right. Uh, I don't remember who Jock is. <laughs> I don't remember who Jock is. All right. Um, hello. Hello, Blue. This is Jock. <laughs> That's not his voice. Oh, no. Hi, Mr. Jock. Sorry to bother you while you're probably out searching for some nice treasure. You'll see, we have a school trip every year around this time. Special collaboration between our academy and another school. You, and would you believe it, Blue? Your name was one of the ones chosen to attend. Oh, yeah, definitely wasn't. I bet all the good, like, I bet all the ones that saved Area Zero, whatever. <laughs> You'll get to go study and experience the great outdoors to the east in the land of Kitakami. It's a long trip to get this year's destination. I forgot how to do it, so we can't spend too many students this time. You really are a lucky one, getting selected as one of the part participants. <laughs> Come to the school's entrance hall when you're ready to hear all the details. Of course, you don't have to take part, but you did spend almost $60 on this, so you should. But this kind of chance isn't likely to come again, so you should go give it a shot if you're interested. See you soon. Okay, well, okay, we got someone to go... I don't even know where I am. Oh, that's right. I was hunting down some... So there's a thing here. I was like, hey, I'll give it a try. Welcome back uh, to Pokemon Violet. Feels like just yesterday, or just last month even, even though it's not, uh, that we were um, doing the original series. Uh, and we concluded it, we did Area Zero, it was dope, and now we're back with the DLC as promised. Holy crap! Holy crap! Oh! I came up, I've always wanted one of these. Okay. All right. Uh, uh, ooh, I wanted it in a luxury ball, though. Does it have roar? Oh, no. I hope not. Uh, okay. I, I kind of hope I just get it. One. I, nope. Flame whip. Okay, okay. That's fine. I've always wanted a shiny gravel. <laughs> um, I, I guess a, I guess a repeat ball does look good for it, but a luxury ball just fits so much nicer for it. You know, I'm gonna keep trying for one. Let's go, critical. You're mine. We got a new Pokemon for the journey for a new s s kind of separate series. <laughs> ah, yeah. Oh, uh, Floatzel's not. Charlie's not coming with us. Cookie is though. Whew. Growlithe, the poppy Pokemon. Very friendly and faithful to people, he'll try to repel enemies by barking and biting. Meet Bumblebee, because you look like a bumblebee. Oh my god, a new journey! And we got a shiny Pokemon within the- like, holy crap! Oh, this is, this is a good sign, right? This has to be a good sign. I'll be honest, I have no idea what to expect. Mainly because Pokemon didn't really release, like, anything about the DLC. So it's gonna be, like, a lot of surprises. You look like you don't belong here. Mr. Jock said the students for the school trip would be around here. You look cool. I like your scary eyes. Hmm. Are you? Oh, you must be. You're one of the students chosen for the school trip, aren't you? Your name was... Blue. Blue, ma'am. I'm not going to say ma'am because it hurts people's feelings. Blue, huh? I guess it depends on the girl. Well, aren't you full of fire? You're absolutely... That's my, that's my two fire Pokemon, thank you. You're positively dazzling. Oh, well, thank you. That's so kind of you. Oh, and you even have a Terra Orb. You're suspicious. <laughs> I guess Baldea is rich enough in resources for that sort of thing to be a common sight at school. Unless that's not the case. Are you perhaps an especially exceptional student? Oh, but here I go on and on, and I haven't even introduced myself. Call me... Miss... Br Miss Briar! I'm so sorry I'm late. Oh, hello to you too, Blue. What a lucky scamp you are, getting to take part in the school trip so soon after transferring here. I'm so happy for you. I wish I could go to... Ahem. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Briar. I got carried a bit away. Well, Miss, Mr. Jacques is so kind to kindly stated for me. My name is Briar. 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 <laughs> I'm a teacher over here at Blueberry Academy. That's a school in the Unova region. That's a school in the Unova region. Ah, uh, yeah, you know Unova games are coming next. That's enough signs. <laughs> you know Miss Briar helps set the curriculum there. 
This year is Blueberry Academy's turn to run our joint school trip and supervise the students. That's why I came to here to collect you. We'll be heading to Kitakami, a land known for its picturesque fields and rice paddies. The place has a rustic feel, but there's also something rather mysterious about it. You see, the same pr energy present in Paldea's terrestrial ter 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 phenomenon has also been detected there. I'm hoping to do some digging into the matter myself, in between my supervising duties, of course. Though I'd also appreciate the chance to take a good look around the great crater of Paldea. Ah, yes, well, that's... I'm not much I can do about that without permission from the Pokemon League and the director of the travel. Oh, I know. I've already put in all the proper applications. I trust I'll get a favorable response soon. Ah, well, hmm. You gonna change the subject? Oh, sorry, Blue. I forgot all about you for a moment there. Ah, I see what you're doing. Anyway, the school trip. Think of it as a chance to ex continue the treasure hunt in the grander scale. To search beyond Baldea's borders. I'll even provide you with a special update to your Pokedex app. If you could get out your phone, please. I think it's still the Arceus one we use, right? Yep. Sick. The Kitakami Pokedex has been added to the Pokedex app. Hence, there we go. All done. Now you can go wild registering all the Pokemon you'll find around Kitakami, too. Oh, it's not very about the permission slip for our trip. I have to clear things for you with your monitor. Oh, good. Thank you. You just go and have fun. Hi. Haha, <laughs> Mr. Zuck. Wait, haha, <laughs> Mr. Zuck is quite charming, isn't he? D delightfully direct when he wants to be. You are a little dense. Now then, Blue, it's quite a trip to the land of Kitakami. I hope you don't mind flying or long buzz rides. Let me know as soon as you're ready to set out, won't you? Oh, I'm ready! We got our team! I feel good, I'm gonna save just in case! Because I'm worried maybe maybe the last time I saved it didn't actually save. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Yes, I am! I put on my clothes a while ago. Great. We'll be, we'll be all together as a group once the trainers arrive, once the other students arrive. I, I hear you were chosen for this trip by lottery. This may be the first time you meet. I know my role is to chaperone you kids around, but I fully intend to have some fun of my own. While I'm at it, just so you're aware. By the way, did you know of the Violet book? I know it. I don't want to say it. She's suspicious. Really? Well, that's unexpected. I'm quite sure at least one copy's been donated to the school. The author of the Violet book, Heath, was in fact an ancestor of mine. I even has a, have his original manuscript. Uh-oh. Look here. These are the pages that were blacked out and made illegible to publish. Made il eligible to publish. El ineligible in the published version of the book. I'm trying here. <laughs> it has been a really long couple of weeks. Nap and Saf can attest to it, all right? A disc Pokemon. While separated from the research team in the crater's depths, I found a strange entity. Whether it was a Pokemon or even alive at all, I don't know. It bore a shell layered with layers of overlapping hexagons that gleamed brighter till still brighter still than gemstone. As a, okay, viewed as a whole, it resembled a mysterious, brilliant disc. I have tentatively named this creature Terrapagos. I suspect that its very body is made is made up of the key material that causes Pokemon to shine brightly and crystallize. The Pokemon depicted in these pages is called Terrapagos. The mysterious Pokemon he encountered while he delved further into the depths of Area Zero. Not that the general public believed him. It's my dream to find Terrapagos and prove that Heath's records were all true. Though I haven't yet been able to secure permission to enter Area Zero, unfortunately. Well, maybe you will, but that's fine. It'll all be fine. All I need to do now is focus on work that's right here in front of me. Miss Breer, we're ready to go! Looks like the gang's all here. Alright everyone, to the land of Kitakami. A Dragonite! Oh my god! I have a, I have a box I have a box in this game full of Dragonites. <laughs> I love Dragonite. The Hidden Treasure of Area Zero.
part one. The teal mask. Oh, that was a sick intro. <laughs> that was very clean. I really enjoyed that. I'm getting way better vibes from this than I did uh, Sword and Shields DLC. We're finally here. My butt is killing me after after all those hours sitting. First the plane, then that bus. <laughs> well, you all survived the long trip. And we haven't lost anyone along the way. All here. Then welcome to the land of Kitakami. This is a stage for all new... <gasps> for all new <laughs> I'm sorry, it's late. <laughs> I accidentally walked like three hours, like not three hours, like two hours today. It's actually my first first time here too. Why the rice fields were just dazzling in like humid heat. I got I mentioned that like two hours in the lawn, but humid heat and circles like it's a lot. Up ahead is Musu Town, Masu Town, Masui Town. That'll be our base of operations for the duration of the trip. Miss Breer, I don't feel so good. <laughs> Peter, no. Uh oh, all that travel must have given you a dose of motion sickness. Hmm? Why don't we pause here for a moment and take in the sight of these fields? Now, Blue, I have a little request of you. Could you run ahead to the community center in Masui, Masui, and let the caretaker know we're here? It would also be great if you explained that one of our students is ra rather feeling unwell. I'm on it. I knew I'd be able to count on you. On your way, then. I'll look after your poor travel buddy here. Oh my gosh, there's so many things! No, stop that. What the... What was that? Why can we whistle? Can we... Can we always whistle? I didn't think we... Could we? I didn't... I don't remember trying. Yan my. What's that? Poochiana! Sick. This is not going to be a repeat of our first episode. I promise you, it is not going to be a repeat of our very first episode. That kid will be fine. It's just a little jet lagged or whatever, man. Probably a TM that's like really not great. Nasty plot. You know, I'm wrong. That's pretty da dank. What? Nick? What? Well, you never say that like that. <laughs> Whoa. Spin her back. Oh, I'll put you in it. <laughs> Whoa. So wah wah. So wah wah. I never finished White 2. I'm not going to finish White 2. But, uh, um, I, uh, we had a Sawaddle in there. It evolved into Lee Ebony. It was dope. It was my first Lee Ebony. <gasps> Corefish! I've never trained one! I want to! No! I was really hoping it would be a little too weak. Cookie, I'm proud of you. But holy crap, bud. I'm so happy to see so many Johto Pokemon. Like, just in general. Johto holds a very special place in my heart. Another core fish! This time I won't kill you. I promise. Get dang roasted it almost. Okay. We're good. You can catch this puppy. A Pokeball, go! Eventually. Okay, there we go. One shaky. Two shaky. Three shaky. Yeah! Core fish was caught. I'm kind of digging the music so far. Ah, oh, Vulpix! Those are- that's a sick hoodie thing you got going there, bud. Uh, sis, look! There! There's one now! Ah. So you're one of those students who came from the Paldea region, huh? Whoa, way cool. Hush, Kieran. I'm Carmine. Sorry, but I can't just let an outsider like you wander into Mosu Masui Town. If you insist on coming in, you'll have to battle me first. Come on, sis. You just want to battle. Making a big fuss over nothing. I told you. It's a hush, Kiki. Call oh, Kiki. Just ignore my little brother. Oh, man. Alright, let's do this. Get in position. Uh, okay. We can try. <laughs> I might have to bring some of my Pokemon with me. <laughs> Not just Cookie. I'm gonna have a real good fun with you. Have a real good fun with you? I'm having some real good fun with you. 
What kind of Pokemon are you carrying, huh? Poochiena, I'm gonna destroy you. Get in here, Cookie! Cookie, the Paldea Champion! I saw that! I saw what it said! That's new! <laughs> That's cool! Alright, welcome to Kitakami. Your first experience. Get ready to eat dirt. Oh, no, 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 no. You ain't talking to me like that. I know you ain't talking to me like that! Blade thrower! Oh, wait, we gotta terrestrialize first! <laughs> yeah, terrestrialize! Heck yeah, Cookie! Still beautiful. I love you! <laughs> I really want a crocodile. Or a plush. I, I love crocodile so much. Yeah! Get out, get out of here, Poochiana! Oh, there's a vault picture on the roof! Why are they up there? <laughs> we should get down from there. They're gonna hurt themselves. Poultry guys. Okay. I don't. Alright. That's with Pokemon this gen. And like, love for like kitchen containers. For those Pulte Geist and the other one, I don't even know what it evolved into. I don't remember. But and then we got this thing. Yeah, it's a little weird. You gotta, you gotta admit it. Yeah! Good job, Cookie! <laughs> Snarl up! Yeah! Get out of here. Ultra Geist. Ah, come on, that's just a lucky hit. Not lucky. Skill. <laughs> it was lucky that your stun sword didn't hit, or I would say it's luck, but it feels like you got the direction of like a blind pigeon. Bullpicks? Alright, let's do it. How dare you psychically assault my gator. <laughs> Okay, snarl! No, we can't snarl. Let's hit him with the seed bomb one more time. I would not have put seed bomb on him had uh, someone not told me about the final. Like, had someone not told me that I was gonna get my butt handed to me in the final battle of Area Zero. Because I, I didn't. Because it was a. Um, I don't know which Pokemon. What are the Pokemon? Deli Bird. That Deli Bird was gonna unalive my gator so fast. That's why I put it on it. Wowzers, you wouldn't be my sis! I can't believe it! There's no way you should have been able to beat me! Fine, I guess you pass. Barely. Seems I've got no choice. I'll let you into town, but only if you become one of my grunts and do every little thing I... Uh, oi! What's causing a ruckus out here? Here comes trouble. Come on, Kiki. We're out of here. But, but I... Oh, yeah, I think he just wants a friend. I'm gonna be honest here. Oh, hello there, stranger. You must be one of the students from the Paldean Academy, right? I help run the community center here in Musui Town. I feel there are other things as well, besides... Uh, and a few other things besides. I'll be looking after your group during your visit. I hope those two kids won't give you any group trust now. Were they? Nah. Not at all. I don't know what to do with the two of them. Especially that it can't mean. She's always been a handful, that one. I apologize she gave you a hard time. What's that? I remember your group fell a little by the bus stop. I make it over there and give them a hand to make sure they can make it to town. Of course, there's three people. They can carry her. Carry him. If they got her. <laughs> I'll take I'll take care of everything. You go ahead and get yourself sent to the community center. We'll catch up to you soon. Okay. Bye. I'd like to heal. Okay, I'll put you in for a sec. I like her attitude. I like it. They got more personality going on this island. I'm a fan of this place so far. Thank you so much for your help. I appreciate it. This way, everyone. Oh, this way, everyone. Blue, I owe you well, I owe you one for fetching the caretaker. Our little buddy, travel buddy, is feeling much better now, too. All right, everyone. This is the community center. This is where you'll be staying while you're here in the kids' economy. Plan your, pl the plan was to have you and the students from Blue Bear Academy stay here together. Well, it turns out this space is going to be an all for you, our visitors from the UV, UV Academy. All right, those two kids were originally from this town, weren't they? So, you, you come. Don't be shy. Come on, everyone, pack right in. 
Oh, no need to worry about our shoes or anything. You can leave them in here, on in here. They're extra dirty. Just try to rinse, them or, r rinse off the worst of them while you're using the washing station by the door. What washing? Oh, I see it. Oh, look at the tingling cake. Nice and clean inside, don't you think? It's all newly built, so it's as good as anything you'd find in one of your big fancy cities. Dogs. With knitwear. And Meg. This here is a lounge. You can watch TV, chat, or relax however you like. And well, let's see. Over there is a the cafeteria. Toilets will be down that way. When you want to get some sleep, please use the room down the hall there. We've got enough space to teach. We have enough space that each of you can have a private room to yourself. So I think that all covers everything. But if you run into any trouble at all, don't you hesitate <coughs> to talk to our fine staff at the desk. <laughs> You're hurting my throat, buddy. Please leave. Thank you for the tour, sir. All right, kids. Do you have anything to say to the staff who will be taking such good care of us? We're glad to be here. Thanks for having us. Thank you for having us. What a bunch of well-mannered students. I can already tell you, you wonderful visitors. So you think this place has your own home away from home? Relax. Yeah, this reminds me of a place I stayed at. When I went across the country for a program as well, actually. I think it was not lottery, but they, they picked me for some for some reason. Uh, you must be all tired after having a long day. It's not me talking. I know it's a bit early still, but why don't we have dinner and then call it a night? We got plenty of food ready for you all. Hope you brought your appetites. Alright! Thanks, sir. Good golly. Jeez. Thanks for dinner. morning everyone did you sleep well starting today you'll be joined by our two students from blueberry academy remember blueberry academy is in univa these are gonna be univa kids huge notice to that right go on kids time to introduce yourselves wait no wait she said they were from this town wait what hold on uh hi i'm carmine it's a pleasure to meet you all you outsiders i mean past visitors from Paldea. <laughs> uh, Kieran. Carmine? Carmine and Kieran actually grew up here, so ask them for help if you need anything. And you do it, but it'd be of real help. You hear me? Aye, aye. Right. I'm feeling suspicious of everything here. Now, as I said, I want to tell you a little bit about what we have planned for you. This school trip of yours will be an exercise in orienteering. First, we'll have you split into pairs. Then each pair will be tasked with finding three signboards located around this land of Kitakami. On each signboard, you'll find snippets of old folktale passed down here in Kitakami. Read them all, learn a bit of our home. To prove you completed the task, we ask that each pair take a snapshot together in front of these signboards with their phone or camera. Take a photo together in each of the three signboards to complete your mission. Self-guided tour of Kitakami. Learn all of its rich history. Much more fun than sitting around listening to me ramble on and on, eh? Wonderful. What an innovative idea for a group activity. Oh, and I want to get for each of you as well. New clothes. <gasps> a selfie stick. Cool. Thank you, sir. That's very kind of you. Selfie mode. What? Well, I think there was already a selfie mode. I just refused to use phone photo mode in, like, any game. <laughs> I heard these things are all the rage in big cities. Yeah, like, ten years ago. Use them when you take these photos. You and I'll teach you the right poses. I came up with all on my own. The Eureka. Yeah, good job. Ah, oh, yes, real rad. Remember that one of the goals of this trip is to deepen the ties between our two schools. Seems like having someone who knows the area well would be a big help. That being said, let's try to maximize the number of inter-school pairs, okay? Time to mingle. Okay. So basically, between those two. You're blue or whatever, right? Let me guess, you want to pair up with one of us poor lonely blueberry students. You guys are going to pair up together despite the rules, aren't you? Gosh, it's so sweet of you to go out of your way like that. What would we ever do without you? 
Oh yeah, so my little brother here has been all googly eyed over you since yesterday. Uh, is it because I'm a champion or something? We wouldn't stop talking about you, even at home. I couldn't get him to shut up. Uh, sis, what are you telling him that for, dummy? Hey, watch who you call dummy if you know what's good for you. Oh man, oh, I feel sad for this kid. Look at him being all shy. You don't have to like humiliate him like this. I don't think anyone deserves that. Even your brother. He's your brother. This feels a little much. See, my brother's no good at talking to people. He'd probably never work up the nerve to ask you himself, but he'd really like a battle with you. you sure? Well, what do you know? It turns out you're sorta of nice. This'll make my brother real happy. Chin up, Kiki. Blue says he'll battle you. What? Wowzers! <laughs> he did not say wowzers. But wowzers, really? You don't mind? He doesn't mind a bit. Get to your positions, you two. Everyone else clear out. Make some space. I, I got this. He's gonna trounce me. This kid got some magic Pokemon. Probably that turtle. Oh no, my timer! No! At a time around for 30 minutes, so we're going over 30 minutes. We might end it during this, after this, and we get our partner, and then next time we'll do this other stuff. Cedric! Cookie! Roast this squirrel. Wowzers, I can't believe this. I get to battle you. This is awesome. Watch him be like a bad guy. He's probably... I really do not like how his sister's treating him. Alright, flamethrower! Yeah! Good stuff. Hey, you sentry. Flamethrower! You got this, Yama. Cut through the wind and show them what you got. Sonic Boom? Is that what you're about to do to me? Air Cutter! Hey! I'm used to expecting Sonic Boom from the thing. Flamethrower! I'm sorry. I'm loving all the Johto love, though. Oof. <laughs> I guess I got a lot of weaknesses. Yeah, it's called... No... I mean, yeah, you do, but... Buddy. <laughs> I feel really bad. I wish I would have let him win. Don't worry! That that was a nice roar little thing he just did. Wowzers. What are these cartoon characters? I feel like I'm in an anime. What are you doing the chicken dance for? <laughs> what? Okay, you, you need a wedgie. Alright, good show. Nicely done, kids. Nothing like a friendly battle to get to know someone. Wowzers, you sure are strong, Blue. You really aren't half bad. Kiki's nearly as strong as I am, you know. I don't know about that. This orient's hearing thing. We're supposed to group up in pairs, right? You should go up. You should go ahead and pair up with Kiki then. What? No, sis, don't. I don't. I'm. Pr He's interested in one of three reasons. He's either interested in us because we're, we became we became a champion level, right? Not the champion, but a champion. Uh, we reached that rank. Two, they know that we can terrestrialize and they want to take our terrestrialization away from us. They're like, they're going to lead us to like the third signpost. They're going to steal it. And then we're going to have to hunt them down. Something like that. Or three, you got a crush. Either one. But don't what? It's not like we can pair up. We can pair up. Or were you hoping to partner with some other rando outsider outside of blue? Well, no, but... Oh, man. Don't worry. He's just being shy. I'll go find some chump to pair up with, too. Watch out for my little bro, you. You're definitely pairing up with the nerd. No question. Looks like you're all... Look like you're all paired up. Let's go out and mock the way you'll be going on his road to phones of yours. <laughs> you didn't do the thing. Uh, now then, off we go to do some exploring. Oh, and find yourself in need of potions and Pokeballs or the like, head on over that way and stop by Peachy's. They'd be happy to set you right. Um, so it looks like we should probably start with the signboard at Loyalty Plaza. That's uh, past the Apple Orchards on the west side. It's close by, and I figured it might um, make sense to, you know, visit them all in order. I'll probably just get in your way if I stick too close, so I'll just follow you from a safe distance. What? Dude, we're partnered for our project. Dude! 
That's not a safe distance! That's like... That's... That's a restraining order distance! Where did you go? Did my partner ditch me? What a way to end it. <laughs> We're gonna continue next time getting those three side posts. I think this is a fun episode. I'm so excited for this DLC. It's gonna be so much fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, comment, hit that like button. I love you all, you awesome. Loot Hoots! Hold on! Loot Hoot! Root! Root! Hey! I love Ah, you're done! Alright, all right, that's enough. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next time. I'm so excited. Look at him. <laughs>